Hi, this is Johnny. I just got a package. I went and ordered the video call for the two-player counter cat that people have been asking about. That hey, Johnny, and they turn out they do have one that they have upgraded. It's a poor generation one, two, and generation three. So like Mortal Kombat, NBA Jam, Ninja Turtle, and then Marvel. Uh, Marvel Superhero, the two-player cabinet, and they listed the picture. So we're gonna open this up. Man, it's real tight. I hope I didn't break, uh, cut any back. So I'm gonna open it up, compare it with this one. See, is any difference between the the one I bought for Generation Two? Are they compatible the same or what? Okay, so. This is, I bought two packages, so it should be two, two of everything. Based on what I see, it look identical, okay? And it comes with uh, the network cable. And for people who have Raspberry Pi, uh, Raspberry Pi 4. So it support Raspberry Pi 4 and Raspberry Pi 3. So it comes with adapter, which is cool. And it, so both of them come with adapter, HDMI cable, and it also come with uh, both cable. Now this time it seems like they wrote down voltage three. So in Pi there is a uh, voltage uh, five and a three. So you want to plug it into a voltage three, so that way we won't damage the the system. And they gave you uh, instruction. And they gave me two, I think two candy. When I first opened, it was two. Yeah, there's two <laughs> candy for you to suck on. It's from uh, Greek Sale from eBay. I like this. I like both of this flavor. It's pretty nice. Uh, orange and grape. Great. So I might suck on that later. All right. And then it tell me uh, it have... Let me cover my address. It, it tell me it has quantity of two, five star feedback possible. I pay it's thirty five fifteen, and I pay seventy dollar for it on my own pocket. Uh, for this review, it's to help people who want to know how to get uh, the counter cap working. Okay, so it say this is for the speaker. It's the same as this one. This two is for speaker. Okay, HDMI in, which is this one right here. HDMI in, and the power in micro SD card. And then here for L LCD adjustment, so you could put in a LD adjustment. And then here is a voice and power switch so you plug that to control control the voice or you could plug uh, to the voice and power switch style one style two so yours is going to more likely be this one and then this one is the shutdown power oh sorry there's two pages but but there's only one page <laughs> one page go to the next next side it, the paper look kind of faded out. Let me show you how to put the bracket. So it's identical to, pretty much identical to this one. Okay, so those of you who haven't seen that video, might want to take a look. Yeah, it's identical to this one. Uh, let me open one of them up to see what is, is there anything different? Uh, is it the exact same thing? Because I think it's the exact same thing. Now, I, I love this uh, blue cable. It's pretty handy. And you can plug into the pot. But yeah, it looks like a, it's a identical thing. But yes, they do want you to plug that power voltage to a 3. Oh, it does come with that extra screw that we use over here. Where is the extra long screw? This one. This time, instead of silver, they gave you a black one. They gave you a black one instead, okay? Uh, instead of red, they gave you an orange color 3D printed out. Uh, I 
could get this thing out. Okay, I don't want to lose any uh, anything like pulling it out. Okay, we're gonna take this screw out. Last time I have an extra little screw, which this time they realized nobody uses, so they took it out. And they look like they put glue here, so this wire won't be dangling everywhere like before. Well, this one, it does not have the. I don't think it does. I hope they test this out before they send it. Okay. So it is exactly the same, but you want this side to be over here. And they also say, please use voltage three on your Raspberry Pi three. And I will go over that when we put this together. And I think the board is pretty much the same. It's a microphone 3.5. Can y'all see all that? Now mine is already installed it, so I can't see the back of it. But on the old one, but this is the new new model. This is what it looked like. And here's the size of the other thing right here. Okay. So, yeah, but the cable wise is exactly the same thing. Oh, there's some more extra, extra stuff here. Those of you who's curious, it doesn't have nothing solid to it. It's just there. I don't know. It's used. But this is the, the exact same thing. Exact same print. It just look a little bit different. So go like that. Huh, I guess you could hold it easier by having this piece here. Okay. So no extra screw, just one screw this time instead of those two other ones that they have given us. So the way you pop this in is you, you put this behind you like this. Like like I did. And oh wrong way. Because your wire your video is gonna go here, the cable. So you want to put this behind it. Uh, this thing is not twisted correctly, so you're gonna so you're gonna put this one over here, more like this. And you're gonna snap onto it. I think the wire this time is shorter than before. So I'm gonna snap it right here. Oh, sorry, I lose focus. Okay, so you're gonna snap it here, and then this you're gonna leave it over here. So before you even slide that in, you're going to pop this in like this. So you're gonna have this cable beneath below that. And this one over here. So you're gonna have this corner in. Here, yeah, let me stand up so I can see what I'm doing. So you make sure you guys, and this part you just push down, snap, see that? And the this hole is gonna be, this corner will be in this corner, like this. Okay, so I put this wire underneath to this side. See, like that. See, last time I didn't show you that because I fast forward the video. And so this one is going underneath here, like this one, and it's going to come up here. So when you put this in, you're going to turn this around and snap it in here. And this piece. It would just snap in like this. Just hmm. the 3D printing it is not very accurate this time. A little bit thicker so it doesn't go in. It doesn't go in like last time. So it's a little bit too the whole, this this thing is a little bit too thick. It doesn't pop in like last time. 
like easy like last time even though I press force on it, it won't all right we will deal with it after we put this in so you pretty much just snap this back on you already came loose already okay you're gonna put the long screw uh, when you put the when you put this thing in so that's supposed to go into that hole and then this one's supposed to screw into using this this one right here this one's supposed to go in here okay like that so you're gonna put the original screw one two three four and then you're gonna snap this here and put this screw in here so it's gonna be look exactly like this the same thing all right so before we could do all that we had to take the the cabinet apart I really don't want to take more marble cabinet because I really don't like the way the the joystick layout I'm not used to more of a compact joystick layout I prefer the old-fashioned way where it's a one two three four five six I don't like the way the six button is down here so I don't think I will mod mod the the Mortal Kombat. I'm thinking about modding the NBA Jam. That's because that's the least cabinet, the my least favorite cabinet. Because I really don't, the game I don't I don't quite understand why if I'm not touching it, it's shooting the ball by itself instead of standing standing still. So that's something that I will probably mod. All right, so let's go to let's go pick one and then we're going to mod it and we're going to put Raspberry Pi 4 with the new image I just created. So we're going to put it on and see how it look. All right.